Hello everyone, welcome to our Timeless Sunset Tarot. Now this is a general reading and it is open to all zodiac signs. So just take what resonates with you. It is also timeless, so anytime you find yourself watching this video, there might be a message here for you. Now let's try to find what is the main energy for the end of the day. We have here the Seven of Pentacles. You have a certain job or a certain project or a certain endeavor. It can even be a relationship that you have invested a lot in the past. And because of that effort that you have exerted, you are now uh, reaping the benefits of it. In fact, it has grown not only in the physical sense, but it has also effects in your inner life. When you look at it, there are a lot of growth already in the roots. So whatever this thing, endeavor that you have immersed yourself in the past, it has somehow flourished at this time. Now, at this moment, you are taking a pause and trying to understand or trying to analyze the situation you are in right now. Whether you will continue on this endeavor, which is very at this time is really really show signs of flourishing or will you start another endeavor or move on to something else so this is the main energy that i could feel right now uh, you are right now in the process of making a decision now let's try to see how this will further unfold okay whatever decision you will make whether it will be to continue on this endeavor or to change, or maybe pursue something else, it will lead to success. Because this one, the first one that you did, is already flourishing, and definitely it will lead to success. So it has good omen, or good possibilities. However, if you will choose to take another path, a new one, it will also bring you joy. We have here the sun. So the sun shows... Uh, joy and contentment. So whatever choice you will make, the important thing is you follow your heart, you choose what you feel will make you happy. So if, for example, continuing this path will make you happy, then follow it. If changing your path or your direction will make you happy, then follow it. Somehow this card is telling you, follow your passion. Whichever will make you happy, don't be afraid to pursue it. So if you, you can either continue or choose another one, the important thing is whatever your choice will be, it will be something that will set you on fire, something that will make you happy, something that will give you a sense of fulfillment. Now, what is the advice of the universe for us? Well, it's going to be uh, a long endeavor. We have here the Knight of Pentacles. The Knight of Pentacles is someone who is known for his dependability and someone who is patient with regards to doing things. So in a certain sense, you see here, the Knight of Pentacles just continues on working. So you, this, you see here, a lot of Pentacles here, the Seven of Pentacles, and here we have the Knight of Pentacles. Pentacles or good fortune is following you. Now you just need to be diligent and patient in whatever you will pursue. Whether you will continue this endeavor or whether you will start something new, the important thing there is you are patient and diligent in pursuing your dream. When you do that, fortune, stability, and joy will follow you. So whatever choice you make at this time, it's okay. The important thing is it sets you on fire, makes you feel alive. Okay, so this is what we have. Let us now go to insights at Twilight. For our insights at Twilight, we have here the Cosmic Reading Cards by Nari Anastasia. Let's try to see what is the Oracle card for our insights at Twilight. Okay, it says here, let go. So for some of you, if you are considering of letting go of something, don't be afraid. Don't be afraid to let it go. As long as you pursue a new chapter with passion, 
you will still succeed. As long as you will be patient, just like the Knight of Pentacles, whatever endeavor you will follow, you will succeed. Now, maybe letting go also is not to be too worried on what will happen. Let go is let go and let the spirit. So just follow the spirit uh, where the spirit is leading you. Try to see where the spirit is leading you. Is the spirit leading you to uh, continue this endeavor or is the spirit leading you to something new? If whatever the spirit uh, inspires you to do, there is that saying, let go and let God. Let go and let the spirit. Let go and let the divine. Trust the spirit where it is leading you. Follow your inspiration. Follow that path that sets you on fire. Uh, follow a path also that has love in it and enjoy the journey breathlessly. So don't be afraid. Let go and let the Spirit guide you. Things will turn out fine and fortune will follow your way. Well, that's it for today. I hope you're able to benefit from our reading. Thank you for the likes and comments you've given to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. I hope to see you again soon. Until that time, May God continue to bless your ways.